that style And you know how to please And a smile that makes me weak in the knees If you're a guy who is gentle and tough You might be the man who's mad Good morning, folks. Um, it's time to check out a new little building project. Um, since Phoenix made something, a, made me a character in one of her settlements, and actually made me a pretty badass character in one of her settlements, uh, I wanted to make something for her in return. So she said she wanted something kind of girly with flowers and potted plants. So what I have done has come to Abernathy Farm and created her a salon. Now, she said she kind of liked small houses, but I didn't feel like I could do what I wanted to do here with small house, so she gets a pretty big one. Though she doesn't live there by herself, she has uh, accommodations for her staff. Uh, here comes her uh, hairdresser, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Uh, in terms of uh, flowers, I'll probably have to come back and revisit this one. I've put um, uh, hub flowers outside, but because they're new, they haven't bloomed yet. And we've got some um, uh, mutated ferns, some wild mute fruit, and some domesticated mute fruit, and some also some wild carrot flowers. So this this will look much better once they come into bloom. Uh, this also nicely contributes to the um, uh, food supplies of the settlement and provides a convenient resource for um, uh, making some kinds of chems and some kinds of drinks. We have a nice place for people to sit on the porch while they're waiting for their turn in the salon. She's apparently having trouble navigating her way upstairs to where she's supposed to work. We have some more uh, chairs for in sitting around here. There is a bar in here, and there is Phoenix herself tending the bar in her nice outfit. She has her own little resting divan over here for when they, she gets some breaks between customers. Yes. Uh, kitchen back here. That's a small one. Uh, not fully decorated yet. I keep finding that I need to collect more junk to have all the things I need to put around the place. But there's a nice little chemistry station here for mixing a few things for customers. Um, I'll probably put a um, uh, mat for a um, uh, clinic in here so that some, they can come in and buy themselves some chems if they need them. Uh, we also have a stove for cooking some light meals for the customers. We've got some of the supplies for that over here. Still have to work on filling up that shelf. And of course the bar supplies back over here. This was a very uncooperative shelf with putting thing, anything except on the top, so it's probably just going to stay that way. Uh, back here we have the staff room where they get to sleep and keep their clothes and whatnot. And up here we have another little waiting and chatting area and the actual salon hairdressing station itself. We'll put some appropriate things on these uh, shelves at some point. Here is Phoenix's personal uh, abode, her little boudoir, as it were. Which she does not leave, just hanging open all the time, actually. And an upper porch where you can get a nice view of the Commonwealth, sit out and Enjoy some time with your friends, maybe even do a little bit of grilling on the porch. So, uh, I need to put some magazines in the magazine rack because we don't want people to be bored out here. But I'll pr try to get some more decorations in and come back and revisit it. But I wanted to let Phoenix have a chance to see how things were progressing with her salon at Abernathy Farm. Thanks for watching, everyone. Mm.